Hello, my name is Bumika and this video is regarding a civil project on Badami Caves and this project is present, presented by Dhanushri, Pranjali and myself. The word Badami from the Badami Caves have been derived from the Persian word Badam which means almond and was the capital of Chalukya kingdom from the 6th to the 8th century AD. Badami Chalukyas was founded in the CE 540 by publication 1 from CE 535 to 566 as an early ruler of the Chalukyas is generally regarded as the founder of the early Chalukya line. An inscription record of this king engraved on a boulder in Badami records the fortification of the hill above Watapi in 544. Pulikation's choice of this location for this capital was likely dedicated by strategic consideration since Badami is protected on three sides by rugged sandstone cliffs. His son Kirti Verman I, CE 556 to 598, and his brother Mangalesha, CE 598 to 16, constructed the cave temples. The Agastya Lake, formerly Watapi Lake, is a man made lake, a water infrastructure completed in the 7th century, likely as a strategic source of water for the capital and around which many Hindu temples were constructed. Kirtivarman I strengthened Watapi and had three sons, Pulikeshin II, Vishnuvardhana, and Buddha Varasa, who at his death were minors. Kirtivarman's one brothers, Mangalesha, ruled the kingdom mentioned in the Mahakuta pillar. Inscription. In 610 CE, the famous Pulikation II came to power and ruled between CE 610 to 642. Watapi was the capital of the early Chalukyas, who ruled much of Karnataka, Maharashtra, parts of Tamil Nadu, and Andhra Pradesh between the 6th and 8th centuries. Under the Badami Chalukyas, Badami emerged as one of the Malaprabha Valley region center of arts, a cradle of Hindu and Jain temple architecture schools. Both Dravida and Nagara style of temples are found in Badami. Along with those in Ayahole, Patatkal, and Mahakuta. Many of these temples in Badami, such as Eastern Bhutanatha Group and Jambulingeshwara Temple, were built between the 6th and 8th century. They are the key to understanding the development of temple architecture and arts, as well as the Karnata traditions of arts around the mid first millennium CE. These sites also contain many increasingly sophisticated temples and arts from the Rashtrakutas and the later Chalukyas, such as the North Bhutanatha Temple Group of Temples and the Yelamma Temple completed through the early 13th century. These Badami Chalukyas were conquered by the armies of the Delhi Sultanate. Badami and other sites in the Malprabha region were fought over by the Hindu kings of the Vijayanagara Empire and the Islamic sultans of the Deccan region. The Vijayanagara kings commissioned expanded fort walls in Badami and elsewhere. Many ruins, the fort and some well-preserved temples in high hillocks survive and attest to the rich heritage of Badami and nearby sites from these centuries. Architecture Badami was the erstwhile capital of the Chalukya dynasty, whose rulers were passionate about the arts, architecture and literature. They built the stunning rock-cut cave temples with a series of exquisite sculptures carved from the sandstone cliffs. The architecture stunner consists of four rock-cut cave temples dating back several centuries. The caves are part of UNESCO designated World Heritage Site. At the mouth of Raven between two rocky hills, the cave temple of Badami overlooked the man-made Agastya Lake. The place earlier known as Watapi is situated around 150 km from the town of Belgam. The architecture includes structures built in the Nagara and Dravidian style, which is the first and most persistent architectural idealism to be adopted by the early Chalukyas. The cave temples at the 7th century site of Badami represent sophistication of Chalukyas architecture. The first cave is dedicated to Nataraja, the dancing figure of Shiva, with more than 80 forms of the ideal carved in red sandstone. The second cave is dedicated to Vishnu. The third cave is the largest cave which is dedicated to giant carved figures of different forms of Vishnu that is Narasimha, Varaha and Trivikrama. The fourth cave is the smallest cave which is dedicated to Lord Mahavira, the founder of Jainism, is depicted in a seated posture inside the cave. The beauty of architecture is the Badami Fort, which is at the top of the hill was residence of Chalukya's king, when Badami was their capital city. The Pallavas destroyed the fort, which was renovated by Tipu Sultan. There is a watchtower in Badami Fort, 
strategically placed which also consists of large granaries and underground chambers finally the bhutna temple on agastya tirtha is a scenic lake at foot of badami hills these are some of the popular architectural places in badami thank you badami caves are 1 km in long this group of four caves temples have been carved out of the hill opposite badami fort the chalukyan king mangalesha was responsible for the completion of these cave temples of the four three are brahmanical while the fourth is jain nearly 2000 steps have to be climbed to reach the cave cave 1 this is shaivite cave the important carvings in this cave are an 18 armed dancing shiva a 200 ganesha mahishasura mardini ardhanarishwara and shankara narayana the ceiling is adorned by a serpent motif and other carved figures cave 2 This cave has Vaishnavite influence with panels of Trivikrama and Bhuvaraha. On the ceilings are the carvings of Anathashayana, Brahma, Vishnu, Shiva and other Ashtadikpalas. Cave 3. Another flight of steps takes one to the third cave which is the largest and the best of the lot. This cave has carvings pertaining to both Shaivite and Vaishnavite themes. Panels of Trivikrama, Narasimha. Shankara Narayana Bhuvaraha Ananta Shayana and Harihara are engraved in a vigorous style an inscription found here records the creation of the shrine by Mangalesha in 578 AD there are some fine bracket figures on the pillars of this cave cave for lying to the east of cave 3 the fourth cave is Jain there is an image of Mahavira adorning the sanctum Other carvings here are of Padmavati and other Tirthankaras. A steep climb up some steps cut in a crevice between cave 2 and cave 3 leads to the southern part of Badami Fort and to an old gun placed there by Tipu Sultan. These are about the cave temples of Badami. Other than these numbered caves, Badami is home to many other cave monuments and medieval era temples. On the other side of the lake, near the Bhutnatha temple, is a 7th to 8th century Chalukya period cave of small dimensions. Inside, there is a carved statue seated over a sculpted throne with reliefs showing people holding chariots, a pipal tree, elephants and lions in an attacking pose. On one side of the statue is a chakra on the other a conch shell but there are several theories as to who the statue represents so it is known as the controversial cave close to this controversial cave are other monuments one of them is a small shrine consisting of a 7th century rock carving of Ananta Shayana Vishnu thank you